Don Knotts, born on July 21, 1924, was a remarkable actor and comedian. His career spanned many years, and he became a household name through his roles on various shows. If you're a fan of classic television, you may remember him from The Andy Griffith Show, Mayberry PD, and McHale's Navy. For those who are too young to have seen these shows, Knotts is perhaps best known for his role as the quirky landlord, Mr. Furley, on the hit show Three's Company. His comedic timing and unique delivery made him a standout performer, and his contributions to the world of television continued to be celebrated today. Despite his many accomplishments, Knotts remained humble and dedicated to his craft throughout his career. His impact on the entertainment industry is undeniable, and his legacy lives on through his classic performances. Whether you're a longtime fan or just discovering his work, there's no denying the lasting appeal of Don Knotts. Don Knotts, the beloved actor, is well known for his role as Barney Fife in the classic sitcom, The Andy Griffith Show. However, his career extended far beyond that, and his fan base spans across three generations. In addition to his work on The Andy Griffith Show, Don appeared in various other TV shows and movies. He starred as the bumbling lawyer, Jesse Haywood, in the 1986 legal drama, Matlock. Don's comedic charm also graced the screen in the animated film, The Little Troll Prince, where he voiced the character of King Gus. Don's career was not limited to just TV and film. He also appeared in various stage productions, including the 1990 off-Broadway play, Quince. Moreover, he starred in the 1998 film, Pleasantville, alongside Tobey Maguire and Reese Witherspoon. The actor's talent did not go unnoticed in the modern era. Don made guest appearances on popular TV shows such as that 70s show, Fatherhood and Robot Chicken. These appearances showcased Don's ability to adapt to different genres and audiences, further solidifying his status as a timeless actor. Don Knotts' career spanned over five decades and his work continues to resonate with audiences today. His comedic timing and unique charm have left a lasting impact on the entertainment industry. It is no wonder that Don has fans from the last three generations who continue to appreciate and admire his work. Don Knotts, the actor known for his comedic roles, had a difficult upbringing as the fourth child of William Jesse Knotts and Elise Knotts. The family lived on a farm outside Morgantown, West Virginia, with little money. Life was a constant struggle for the Knotts family, and the actor's father showed signs of alcoholism and schizophrenia. William Knotts struggles with mental health, and substance abuse took a toll on the family. Eventually, he suffered a nervous breakdown, leaving the family in a state of turmoil. Despite these challenges, Don Knotts persevered and found solace in the world of entertainment. As a child, Knotts found comfort in performing magic tricks and telling jokes to his classmates. He discovered that making people laugh was a powerful tool to distract them from the harsh realities of life. This early discovery set him on a path to a successful career in show business. Knott's father's struggles with alcoholism and schizophrenia had a profound impact on the actor's life. He often drew upon his childhood experiences to create memorable characters that brought joy and laughter to audiences around the world. In his classic roles, Knott's brought a sense of warmth and vulnerability to his characters, making them relatable to audiences of all ages. His ability to make people laugh despite his difficult upbringing is a testament to his resilience and determination to overcome adversity. In the end, Don Knotts' upbringing and family struggles shaped him into the talented actor and comedian that he became. His ability to find humor in even the most challenging situations is a legacy that continues to resonate with audiences today. Don Knotts, born in Morgantown, West Virginia, experienced a challenging childhood due to his father's abuse. William Knotts often terrorized Don, leading his mother, Elise, to move the family into Morgantown and run a boarding house. This relocation aimed to provide a safer environment for Don and his siblings. Unfortunately, Don's father remained a constant source of stress in his life. Bedridden and suffering from pneumonia, William Knotts eventually passed away when Don was only 13 years old. This loss, while difficult, allowed Don to begin healing from the years of emotional turmoil he had experienced. As a result of his traumatic upbringing, Don became shy and withdrawn. However, he found solace in developing a ventriloquist routine as a way to come out of his shell. This hobby not only helped him build confidence, but also ignited his passion for performing. Through his ventriloquist act, Don discovered his love for entertaining audiences. 
This passion would eventually lead him to pursue a career in acting, where he would become known for his comedic timing and memorable performances. Despite the challenges he faced in his early life, Don Knotts persevered and found success in the entertainment industry. His ability to overcome adversity and find joy in performing serves as an inspiration to many. Don Knotts, a name synonymous with comedy, got his start performing at local church functions in his hometown. His natural comedic timing and charm made him a big hit among the congregation. After high school, the actor decided to take his talents to New York in pursuit of a career as a comedian. However, he found it difficult to break into the competitive world of show business and eventually return home. Undeterred, Don enrolled in the University of West Virginia, hoping to find success in a different field. But fate had other plans. During his freshman year, he was drafted into the Army, which would ultimately change the course of his life. While serving, Don discovered a passion for performing in front of his fellow soldiers, reigniting his dream of becoming a comedian. After his military service, Don returned to his studies, but the allure of the stage was too strong to ignore. He left college behind and once again set his sights on New York, determined to make it as a comedian. And the rest, as they say, is history. This classic actor's perseverance and determination paid off leading to a successful career that would make him a household name. Don Knotts, the actor well known for his comedic roles, had a fascinating military career before finding fame in Hollywood. During World War II, he served in the U.S. Army from 1943 to 1946, specifically in the Special Services Branch. This branch was responsible for providing entertainment to the troops, and it was here that Knotts found his calling. As part of a performance group called Stars and Gripes, Knotts traveled to the Pacific, entertaining his fellow soldiers. His talent for making people laugh made him a valuable member of the group, and he quickly became a favorite among the troops. But Knotts' talent for entertaining didn't stop at comedy. He was also a skilled ventriloquist, and he often performed with a dummy named Danny Hooch Matador. The duo was a hit, providing a much-needed break from the stress and tension of war. Knotts' time in the Army had a significant impact on his career. Not only did it provide him with valuable experience in performing, but it also gave him the opportunity to hone his skills as a ventriloquist. This unique talent would become a signature part of his act in the years to come, helping to establish him as a beloved comedic actor. In reflecting on Knotts' military service, it's clear that his contributions went far beyond providing entertainment. He brought joy, and laughter to his fellow soldiers during a difficult time, and his talent and dedication to his craft left a lasting impact on those around him. After serving in the military during World War II, Don Knotts returned home with a new perspective. The actor, who had been entertaining his fellow soldiers with a dummy he used for ventriloquism, decided to end the act. As the ship neared its destination, Knotts tossed the dummy overboard, signifying his desire to move on from that chapter of his life. Knotts was honorably discharged as a technician grade 5, and his service was recognized with several awards. Among these was the World War II Victory Medal, which was given to all military personnel who served during the war. Knotts's dedication and hard work were evident in his service, and he received this honor with pride. Once back home, Knotts decided to use his GI Bill to finish college. He enrolled at the University of West Virginia, where he studied speech and drama. Knotts was a dedicated student, and his passion for acting was evident in his coursework. In 1948, he graduated with a degree in speech and drama, setting the stage for a successful career in entertainment. Knotts' time in the military had a profound impact on his life and career. The skills he developed as a ventriloquist and the discipline he learned in the service served him well in his acting roles. His service also gave him the opportunity to finish college, which was a crucial step in his career. Knotts' military service was just one chapter in his life, but it was an important one that set him on the path to success. After moving to New York once more, Don Knotts sought to establish himself in the world of show business. During this time, he found consistent work and even landed a role on the radio program Bobby Benson and the B-Bar B-Riders, where he portrayed Wendy Wales. However, it was on the small screen where Don truly made his mark. His first television role came in the form of a neurotic man on the soap opera Search for Tomorrow. This opportunity allowed Don to showcase his comedic timing and acting skills, paving the way for his future successes. 
Despite facing numerous challenges and setbacks, Don Knotts persevered and continued to pursue his passion for acting. His early roles on the radio and television laid the groundwork for his illustrious career, which would span several decades and solidify his place as a beloved and respected figure in the entertainment industry. Throughout his career, Don Knotts would go on to star in numerous films and television shows, earning critical acclaim and legions of fans along the way. But it was his humble beginnings and his first television role on Search for Tomorrow that truly set the stage for this classic actor's enduring legacy. Don Knotts, the actor, found live television challenging due to its unpredictable nature. Unlike film or theater, where scenes could be reshot or rehearsed, live TV was a one-take affair. This pressure led Knotts to realize that serious roles were not his forte. Instead, he found his niche in comedy. In 1961, Knotts recorded his only comedy album, An Evening With Me. This record featured his popular weatherman routine, which showcased his comedic timing and knack for physical comedy. The album was a success, leading to an appearance on The Steve Allen Show. The Steve Allen Show was a popular variety show that aired from the late 1950s to the mid-1960s. Steve Allen, the host, was known for his humor and ability to bring out the best in his guests. Knott's appearance on the show was a testament to the success of his comedy album. Knott's weatherman routine was a crowd favorite. He played a bumbling weatherman who couldn't seem to get his forecast right. His comedic delivery and physical comedy antics had audiences in stitches. This routine would become a staple of Knott's act and a highlight of his career. In conclusion, Don Knott's experience with live TV taught him that comedy was his strength. His comedy album, An Evening With Me, was a testament to his comedic talent and led to an appearance on The Steve Allen Show. This classic weatherman routine remains a beloved part of Knott's legacy. Don Knotts and Andy Griffith, two talented actors, forged a great friendship while filming the 1958 comedy No Time for Sergeants. This film marked a significant milestone in both their careers and their camaraderie was evident in their performances. Later, when Andy Griffith was offered his own television show, he made sure to include Don Knotts in the cast. Thus, the iconic character of Barney Fife was born, becoming a beloved and integral part of the Andy Griffith show. Don's portrayal of the bumbling, lovable deputy struck a chord with audiences, and his performance was widely praised. In fact, during the first five seasons of the Andy Griffith show, Don Knotts won an impressive three Emmy Awards for his work as Barney Fife. These accolades were a testament to his exceptional talent and the impact he had on the show. His performances resonated with viewers, and his comedic timing and character development were second to none. Throughout their time working together, Don Knotts and Andy Griffith formed a bond that extended beyond their professional lives. Their friendship was a significant one, and it played a crucial role in the success of The Andy Griffith Show. To this day, their work together remains a classic example of the power of friendship and collaboration in the entertainment industry. During the fifth season of his popular show, the actor known as Don Knotts decided to explore new opportunities in film. He signed a five-movie deal with Universal Pictures, which led to the creation of The Ghost and Mr. Chicken. This film was based on an episode of The Andy Griffith Show, with Griffith himself helping to write the script. In this classic comedy, Knotts plays the role of Luther Heggs, a newspaper typesetter who dreams of becoming a star reporter. When a ghost is rumored to haunt a mansion, Heggs sees an opportunity to make a name for himself and decides to spend the night in the haunted house. The movie is filled with hilarious moments and showcases Knotts' exceptional comedic timing. After the success of The Ghost and Mr. Chicken, Knotts went on to star in several other films, including The Reluctant Astronaut, The Shakiest Gun in the West, and The Love God. These movies further solidified Knotts' status as a talented comedic actor. In addition to his film career, Knotts also hosted a short-lived variety show in 1970-1971. The Don Knotts show featured many popular guests, including Johnny Cash, Flip Wilson, and the Jackson Five. Despite its short run, the show was well-received and showcased Knotts' versatility as an entertainer. Throughout his career, Knotts remained a beloved figure in the world of comedy and entertainment. His contributions to the industry continue to be celebrated and cherished by fans of all ages. Don Knotts, the beloved actor, is best known for his comedic roles in television and film. During the height of his career, he became involved in two notable projects, the TV show Three's Company 
in the movie Pleasantville. In Three's Company, Don took on some of Suzanne Summers' lines as Mr. Furley when she was absent due to contract disputes. The show, which aired from 1977 to 1984, followed the lives of three single roommates and their eccentric landlord, Mr. Furley, played by Don. The actor's comedic timing and physical comedy skills made him a perfect fit for the role, and he was able to step in seamlessly during Summer's absence. Later, in the 1998 film Pleasantville, Don played a TV repairman, a role originally intended for Dick Van Dyke. The film, set in the 1950s, follows two siblings who are transported into a black and white television show and must navigate the idealized world of the past. Don's character, the TV repairman, serves as a bridge between the black and white world of the show and the colorful world of reality. Despite being a small role, Don's performance in Pleasantville was memorable and added to the film's overall charm. His ability to bring humor and warmth to any role made him a beloved figure in the entertainment industry, and his contributions to Three's Company and Pleasantville are still celebrated today. In the post-production phase of the beloved film Pleasantville, the actor Don Knotts was unable to participate in the voice work. As a result, comedian Craig Shoemaker stepped in to fill his shoes. Despite the absence of Don Knotts in the post-production process of Pleasantville, his iconic character, Barney Fife, remained a beloved figure in pop culture. In fact, a dedicated fan even commissioned a statue of Barney Fife to be created. However, due to rights issues, the statue was never realized. Thankfully, in the twilight years of Don Knotts' life, he was finally honored with a statue in his hometown of Morgantown. The unveiling took place on July 22, 2016, and served as a testament to the actor's enduring impact on the entertainment industry and the hearts of his fans. Throughout his career, Don Knotts brought joy and laughter to countless audiences. His absence from the post-production of Pleasantville was a mere footnote in the grand tapestry of his life and career. And while the Barney Fife statue may never come to fruition, the love and admiration for the actor and his work live on. In her book, Tied Up in Knots My Dad, and Me, Don Knotts' daughter, Karen Knotts, shares a heartwarming and intimate portrait of her life with the beloved actor. Knotts, best known for his role as the bumbling deputy Barney Fife on The Andy Griffith Show, was a devoted father who instilled in his daughter a love for show business. Karen Knotts recounts growing up as the child of a famous father sharing stories of their time spent together on and off the set. From attending red carpet events to quiet moments at home, the book offers a unique perspective on the man behind the iconic character. The actor's daughter also delves into his early life and career, highlighting his humble beginnings in West Virginia and his rise to fame in the world of comedy and television. She shares her father's passion for performing and his dedication to his craft, as well as his struggles with shyness and anxiety. Throughout the book, Karen Knotts pays tribute to her father's legacy and the lasting impact he had on her life. She reflects on the lessons he taught her, the memories they shared, and the love they had for each other. Tied up in Knotts My Dad and Me is a touching and heartfelt tribute to a classic actor and a loving father. It offers a rare glimpse into the life of Don Knotts, both on and off the screen, and is a must-read for fans of this legendary performer. In the world of entertainment, Don Knotts made an indelible mark with his unique comedic talent. Born July 21, 1924, in Morgantown, West Virginia, Knotts began his career as a ventriloquist and later transitioned to acting. He first gained national attention for his role as Deputy Barney Fife on The Andy Griffith Show, a character that earned him five Emmy Awards. Knotts' portrayal of the bumbling, yet lovable deputy became a cultural phenomenon and solidified his place in television history. But Knotts' career didn't stop there. He went on to star in several successful films, including The Incredible Mr. Limpet, The Ghost, and Mr. Chicken, and The Reluctant Astronaut. His comedic timing and physical comedy skills made him a fan favorite and a staple in the entertainment industry. Despite his success, Knotts remained humble and dedicated to his craft. He continued to act in various TV shows and movies throughout his career, earning him a total of six Emmy Awards and a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Throughout his life, Don Knotts brought laughter and joy to millions of people around the world. His legacy continues to live on through his work, inspiring future generations of comedians and actors. Don Knotts, born Jesse Donald Knotts on July 21, 1924, in Morgantown, West Virginia, was the youngest of four children. 
His father, William, was a farmer and a coal miner, while his mother, Anna, was a homemaker. Knott's childhood was marked by poverty and hardship, with the family often relying on government assistance to get by. Despite these challenges, Knott's found solace in performing. He was a shy child, but he discovered that he could make people laugh, which helped him cope with his anxieties. Knott's older brother, William, was a big influence on him, encouraging his love for performing and even building a stage in their basement for him to practice on. Knott's first exposure to the craft of acting came in high school, where he participated in school plays and developed a reputation as a talented comedian. After graduating, he attended the West Virginia University, where he continued to perform in plays and also began to hone his skills as a ventriloquist. After college, Knott's joined the United States Army during World War II. He served in the Pacific Theater and often entertained his fellow soldiers with his comedy routines. After the war, Knott's returned to West Virginia and began performing in local theaters and radio shows. In the early 1950s, Knott's moved to New York City to pursue a career in show business. He struggled at first, working odd jobs and performing in small clubs and theaters. However, he eventually caught the attention of comedian Red Skelton, who hired him as a writer and performer for his popular television show. Knott's work with Skelton led to other opportunities, including a role in the Broadway play No Time for Sergeants, which earned him critical acclaim and a Tony Award nomination. This success paved the way for Knott's most famous role, that of Deputy Barney Fife on the television show The Andy Griffith Show. Throughout his career, Knott's credited his family, his brother William, and his early experiences in theater and radio as key influences on his path to becoming a successful actor and comedian. He passed away on February 24, 2006, leaving behind a legacy of laughter and a testament to the power of perseverance and hard work. Ever since Don Knotts was a young boy, he was drawn to the world of entertainment. He loved making people laugh and would often put on shows for his family and friends. This passion for comedy led him to pursue a career in acting. Don's big break came in 1956 when he was cast as Deputy Barney Fife on the hit TV show The Andy Griffith Show. His comedic timing and unique delivery quickly made him a fan favorite. Don's character was known for his nervous energy, bumbling antics, and signature catchphrase, nip it in the bud, but Don's journey to stardom was not an easy one. He struggled for years to make a name for himself in the entertainment industry. He worked odd jobs, including a stint as a ventriloquist, to make ends meet. But Don never gave up on his dream. One pivotal moment in Don's career came when he was performing at a nightclub in New York City. A talent scout from NBC was in the audience and was impressed by Don's comedic skills. The scout introduced Don to Andy Griffith, who was looking for a comedic sidekick for his new TV show. The rest, as they say, is history. Don's passion for comedy and his dedication to his craft made him one of the most beloved actors of his time. He went on to star in numerous TV shows and movies, including The Ghost and Mr. Chicken, The Reluctant Astronaut, and Three's Company. In the end, Don Knotts' legacy is one of laughter and joy. He brought happiness to millions of people around the world and will always be remembered for his unique comedic style. Don Knotts, a name synonymous with comedy, faced numerous challenges in his early career. Born in 1924 in Morgantown, West Virginia, Knott's family struggled financially during the Great Depression. As a result, he often took on various jobs to help support his family. Despite his natural comedic talent, Knott's faced skepticism from the industry. Early on, he was told that he was too short and his voice too high-pitched to make it as an actor. However, Knott's refused to let these criticisms deter him. Instead, he used them as motivation to hone his craft and prove his doubters wrong. Knott's turned to radio and theater to gain experience and exposure. He worked tirelessly to perfect his comedic timing and delivery. Eventually, his hard work paid off when he was cast in the role of Deputy Barney Fife on the hit TV show The Andy Griffith Show. Knott's portrayal of the bumbling, yet lovable Deputy Fife endeared him to audiences and cemented his place in television history. Despite his success, Knott's never forgot his humble beginnings and continued to work hard throughout his career. Through resilience and determination, Don Knotts overcame early financial struggles and industry skepticism to become one of the most beloved comedic actors of all time. Don Knotts, born July 21, 1924, in Morgantown, West Virginia, 
found his breakthrough moment in the world of television. In the late 1950s, he was cast as Deputy Barney Fife on The Andy Griffith Show. This role catapulted Knotts to stardom and earned him five Emmy Awards for Outstanding Supporting Actor in a Comedy Series. Knotts' portrayal of the bumbling, lovable Deputy Fife brought a new level of humor to the small screen. His performance resonated with audiences and his comedic timing was often hailed as unparalleled. Andy Griffith, Knotts co-star in the show's lead, once said, Don had a way of delivering lines that was simply hilarious. He could make even the simplest joke funny. In the 1960s, Knotts branched out into film, starring in a series of successful comedies. His role in The Incredible Mr. Limpet showcased his ability to carry a leading role, earning him critical acclaim and solidifying his status as a comedic powerhouse. Critics praised Knotts' unique blend of physical comedy and witty banter, with Variety magazine noting, Knotts' performance is a testament to his comedic prowess, proving that he is more than just a small screen star. Throughout his career, Knott's breakthrough moments continued to accumulate. His work in the 1970s and 1980s included roles in films such as The Apple Dumpling Gang and Cannonball Run 2, as well as a successful run on the game show The Hollywood Squares. Each new project further solidified Knott's place in the annals of Hollywood history. In the end, Don Knott's career was marked by a series of breakthrough moments that showcased his immense talent and versatility. From his groundbreaking role on The Andy Griffith Show to his successful foray into film, Knotts left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry, one that continues to resonate with audiences today. Don Knotts, known for his comedic prowess, brought a unique style to his acting. He approached his work with a focus on physical comedy, using facial expressions and body language to convey humor. Knotts' characters often had a nervous, high-strung energy that made them endearing and relatable to audiences. One of Knott's most iconic roles was as Barney Fife on The Andy Griffith Show. Knott's portrayal of the bumbling deputy sheriff was a testament to his comedic talent. He was able to create a character that was both funny and sympathetic, making Barney Fife a beloved figure in television history. Knott's personal experiences and worldview were reflected in his work. Growing up in a small town in West Virginia, Knott's drew on his own background to create authentic and relatable characters. His characters often had a sense of innocence and optimism despite their flaws and shortcomings. Knott's approach to acting was grounded in his belief in the power of humor to connect with audiences. He once said, I think laughter is very important in life. It's a way of escaping from the sometimes very grim realities of the world. This philosophy was evident in his work, which brought joy and laughter to millions of people. Throughout his career, Knott's remained dedicated to his craft always striving to perfect his comedic timing and delivery. His unique style and approach to acting have left a lasting impact on the world of entertainment, inspiring generations of comedians and actors. Don Knotts, a beloved actor, left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. With his unique comedic style, Knotts brought joy to many through his roles in television and film. Barbara Eden, Knotts co-star in the 1960s sitcom I Dream of Jeannie, spoke highly of his talent. She said, Don had a way of making people laugh that was just magical. His physical comedy and facial expressions became his signature, influencing future comedic actors. In the 1960-65 television series The Andy Griffith Show, Knott's portrayal of Deputy Barney Fife resonated with audiences. His character, a bumbling yet lovable deputy, became a cultural icon. Knott's ability to balance humor and heartfelt moments contributed to the show's success and enduring popularity. Knott's influence extended beyond his acting. He directed several episodes of The Andy Griffith Show and Three's Company, showcasing his versatility. His directorial style was known for its visual humor and clever use of timing, further solidifying his impact on the industry. Industry experts and fans alike agree that Don Knott's contributions to comedy are immeasurable. His influence can be seen in various modern sitcoms and films where physical comedy and expressive faces remain popular. Knott's ability to make people laugh and feel connected to his characters has left a lasting impact on the entertainment industry and those who enjoy it. In the words of Andy Griffith, Don Knotts was the best. There's never been a better Barney Fife, and there never will be. This testament speaks to Knott's unique talent and the void left in his absence. His legacy continues to resonate 
inspiring future generations of comedic actors and directors. Don Knotts, the beloved actor known for his comedic roles, was a family man off screen. He was married twice and had one son. Knotts valued his privacy and enjoyed simple pleasures such as gardening and spending time with his loved ones. Knotts' personal values and interests often informed his work. His humble and down-to-earth personality shone through in his performances, making him relatable and endearing to audiences. Knotts' ability to bring humor to everyday situations was a reflection of his own lighthearted approach to life. In addition to his acting career, Knotts was passionate about giving back to his community. He was involved in various philanthropic efforts throughout his life. Knotts was a longtime supporter of the Motion Picture and Television Fund, an organization that provides financial assistance and healthcare services to those in the entertainment industry. He also lent his time and talents to numerous charitable events and causes. Knotts' love for animals was also well known. He was an advocate for animal rights and worked with several animal welfare organizations. Knott's compassion for animals was evident in his role as the voice of Mayor Turkey Lurkey in the animated film Chicken Little. Despite his success, Don Knott's remained humble and dedicated to his craft until the end of his life. His personal values and passions were an integral part of who he was, both on and off screen. Knott's legacy continues to inspire and entertain audiences to this day. Don Knott's, a beloved actor, left an enduring mark on the entertainment industry. Knotts, best known for his role as Barney Fife on The Andy Griffith Show, brought laughter to millions with his comedic timing and unique character portrayals. His legacy continues to inspire aspiring professionals today. For those hoping to follow in Knotts' footsteps, his advice is simple, stay true to yourself and constantly hone your craft. Knotts once said, I've never been particularly talented. I've never had a great voice or the looks of a movie star, but I've always had a lot of drive. This drive, combined with a dedication to perfecting one's skills, can lead to a successful career in the entertainment industry. In terms of future contributions, the landscape of entertainment is ever-changing. With the rise of streaming services and digital content, there are more opportunities than ever for aspiring professionals to make their mark. By embracing new technologies and platforms, while still staying true to the core principles of storytelling, and character development, future professionals can continue to push the boundaries of what is possible in the entertainment industry. In conclusion, Don Knotts legacy serves as a reminder of the power of hard work, dedication, and a commitment to one's craft. For those looking to make their own mark in the entertainment industry, Knotts advice and example provide a roadmap for success. By staying true to oneself and constantly seeking to improve, Future professionals can create work that resonates with audiences and leaves a lasting impact. Don Knotts, a small town boy from West Virginia, found his passion in entertaining others. After serving in the Army during World War II, he began his career in show business, initially focusing on radio and stage performances. However, it was his role as Barney Fife on The Andy Griffith show that truly catapulted him to stardom. Knotts' unique comedic style, marked by physical humor, and a wide range of facial expressions captured the hearts of audiences. His portrayal of the bumbling, lovable Deputy Fife resonated with viewers and solidified Knott's status as a beloved figure in American television. Throughout his career, Knott's demonstrated remarkable innovation, constantly pushing the boundaries of his craft. He starred in numerous films, including The Ghost and Mr. Chicken, The Incredible Mr. Limpet, and The Apple Dumpling Gang, showcasing his versatility as an actor. Despite facing personal struggles and the challenges of an ever-evolving entertainment industry, Knotts persevered. His unwavering dedication to his craft and his ability to adapt to new roles and formats ensured his enduring impact on the industry. In the world of entertainment, Don Knotts leaves behind a legacy that continues to inspire. His work serves as a testament to the power of creativity and the importance of staying true to one's passion. Knotts' journey reminds us that with determination, and a willingness to evolve, we too can leave our mark on the world. Without a doubt, Don Knotts left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. With his unique comedic style, he brought joy to countless audiences. Born on July 21, 1924, Knotts began his career on stage before transitioning to television and film. His most iconic role as Barney Fife on The Andy Griffith Show earned him five Emmy Awards and solidified his place in television history. 
Knott's portrayal of the bumbling, lovable deputy resonated with viewers and remains popular today. But Knott's was more than just a small town deputy. He showed his versatility in a range of roles, from the nervous hotel guest in The Ghost, and Mr. Chicken to the wise cracking superintendent in The Reluctant Astronaut. His comedic timing and physical comedy skills were unmatched. Beyond his work as an actor, Knott's also lent his voice to animated characters, including Mayor Turkey Lurkey in Halloween as Grinch Knight and Meyer Machise in McDonald's commercials. As we reflect on Don Knott's career and legacy, we encourage you to share your thoughts and memories in the comments below. What was your favorite Don Knott's role or performance? How did his work impact you? And if you enjoyed this celebration of Don Knott's, be sure to like and share this post with your friend and family. And don't forget to subscribe for more content celebrating the creative spirits shaping entertainment. Together, let's continue to honor and cherish the legacy of Don Knotts and other talented artists.